Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. In today's video we will be going over uh, how to craft tinted glass and uh, basically how it works and all that in Minecraft 1.17. This is just the latest Minecraft 1.17 tutorial here on the channel so if you need other tips for Minecraft 1.17 be sure to check out the rest of the channel and consider subscribing if you want to. I uh, don't have to of course. Also if you want to check out my social medias the links are in the description below uh, like my Twitter, my uh, TikTok, all that stuff and before we get into the video i would just like to ask you guys to wash your hands to keep everybody safe and let's finally get into the video and talk about some tinted glass so tinted glass the first thing i really want to talk about is how cool this like inside of the tinted glass actually looks as you can see like it's really dark in there and like the shadow is kind of making another cube inside this bigger stained glass cube or tinted glass cube sorry but uh yeah i just made this really quickly and thought it was really cool just wanted to show it uh in the beginning of the video but yeah let's move on to why most of you are probably here and that's how to craft tinted glass it's a very simple recipe all you're gonna need is a glass and four amethyst shards which you would get from the new uh, amethyst geodes located in minecraft 1.17 underground and you get two tinted glass for each craft so yeah the crafting recipe is very very simple uh yeah not too hard i guess the only thing really hard would be finding the amethyst geode but once you do that uh you should be set to go and you should be able to get all the tinted glass you need all right, so now that we have tinted glass crafted, I just want to kind of explain how tinted glass really works for uh, just in case anyone who doesn't really know. So uh, yeah, as we were talking about it earlier, you can see that shadow box, I guess we can call it inside there. And that's because tinted glass does not allow any light to get through the glass. So uh, yeah, in there, since this whole box is surrounded by tinted glass, there's no light getting in there. Once we break one tinted glass, you'll see actually, well, let's break, let's break this one right here. The shadow box starts to kind of fade away and the more light you let in, the less light actually gets trapped in here. So let's actually close this back up. And uh, we're going to make it nighttime so we could actually see the effects uh, a lot better. It's kind of hard to see it during the day. It is nighttime now and we do have the tinted glass box set up here again. We're going to place one torch inside this tinted glass box. And as you can see, uh, the light is let out because we have this opening right here. But if we actually go ahead and close this, the light will actually not be let out of this box. And as you can see, the inside is actually lit up from that torch. But anything past these uh, uh, barrier blocks or these barrier tinted glass blocks, there's no let, uh, light let, um, being let out, I should say. So I just replaced these six tinted glass blocks with regular glass. And this is a really easy way to uh, showcase how the tinted glass works. So as you can see, there's no light coming out from that side of the glass. And on this side, you can see the light pouring out. So yeah, let's go ahead and close this back up and the light will not be let out anymore. Wow, that's pretty cool. Tinted glass is definitely going to be useful when working around light levels and stuff like that. So uh, definitely a good addition in the game. But uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this Minecraft 1.17 tutorial. As always, please leave a like, comment and subscribe if you're new to the channel. Really, really helps me out. Also, uh, let me know in the comments below which 1.17 tutorial would you like to see next? Uh, yeah, we will be pushing those out. Hopefully we get daily vids for as long as we can go but uh yeah thank you guys so much as always oh i already said that and i'll see you guys in the next one peace